Hey out there, if you were with me on the uh, previous video, you know I got some gold ore from the Rogue River Valley of Oregon running here through my sluice. And I got a bucket here, but uh, it's full of a wide range of particle sizes. It's not ready for the sluice box. Common problem out there, right? So I'm going to run you through my screening procedure here real quick. Uh, what I do is I run it through a couple of buckets. Uh, this is a quarter inch screen and then what I'll do after the quarter is I'll come over here to my little stack of screens and find uh, an eighth and I think everything under an eighth of an inch I'll run through the sluice everything over an eighth of an inch I am gonna take back here to my homemade ball mill and I'm gonna mill it crush it up grind it I mean and get it small enough to run through the sluice. So let's lift up the lid and see what we're looking at here. Ah, this setup was made by me and a friend. We took a treadmill frame, trimmed it down in size, put a keg on it, it's resting on the rollers, and the speed of the keg is controlled by the control panel for the um, treadmill. And so you feed it in right there in the little hole, and uh, the grinding media is heavy duty bolts. And I also have rods. I want to use rods. Um, there's some of it that's been run through. Some of the product. You can see I have quite a few different samples here that I'm working through. And this is even some stuff I'm getting ready to crush. Crushing an angle iron inside of a netted box like this so I can capture the dust and dump this onto a screen and screen it. And so what I'm going to do is I'm going to get some more stuff ready for this sluice box. And I just wanted to run you guys through that screening procedure and how I get this down to size. Give you some ideas for your own projects. See you next time.